Today we're going to be installing the Stitchy Dim, but this also works the exact same way for the Stitchy Switch. Let's start by making sure that the power is off and isolated. Then we can remove the switch plate from the wall. Once you've removed the switch plate from the wall, we want to remove all the cables from the switch, the active, the switch wire, and the neutrals. Let's make sure that you always recognize which cable is the switch wire and which is the active. The first wire, if you turn the unit over, is the light cable, the white one. We're going to connect that directly to the switch wire. And we're going to put that straight into a connector. The second cable, if we turn it over, is the active. And that's going to get connected directly to the active. And that is going to go straight into the active position on the switch. The next cable along is the neutral. We're going to connect that directly in to our neutrals for a strong connection. Last one is the switch wire, the red cable. And that's going to go directly into the switch so we can control the light still. Lastly, before installing the plate back onto the wall, is we have to take the strain off any of the connections. This can be done really simply, just getting a cable tie and attaching it directly to the cables that are coming down the wall, just to remove any strain, like so. Let's fold all the cables and everything back. Let's pop it straight back into the wall, making sure that it's clear from any of the screw points so that we're not gonna pierce anything. Reinstall the plate onto the wall. Once we've got the plate screwed back onto the wall and the cover plate on, we're ready for the next step.